Hi everyone, you got your new Galaxy smartphone or maybe you got it as a gift or even if you buy a used Galaxy smartphone, these are the first thing you must do before using the phone. It goes for any Samsung Galaxy smartphone. So let's start the video. So go to the dialer, type star hash zero star hash. It will take you to this uh, secret or hidden developer menu. Now here you can check each and everything about your phone, especially the hardware. Because software is something you can easily take care of. But suppose something is wrong with your hardware, you must go and replace your smartphone at the same time. Now let's start with the colors. So you notice uh, everything is correct. There is no dead pixel anywhere. You click again to go out of it. Check the green. Again, you don't see any dead pixel anywhere. Again, you tap the screen to come out of it. You check the blue color. You don't see any dead pixel anywhere, even the edges. Again, you tap to come out of it. And to check the receiver, again, you tap it to come out. So the receiver is working perfectly fine. Vibration, you I can't uh, explain in the video. Maybe you can hear the noise. Again, you tap to come out. Also, you check the dimming. I don't know whether it's clear in the video, but when you tap, the display becomes dim. And you, when you tap again, it becomes bright. Maybe it's not so visible in the video. To come out of it, you have to press volume up. Camera. You can take a picture. So you can see the video if you're happy with the result. That means the camera is perfectly fine. Okay, now let's get into some serious uh, hardware functionality. You check all the sensors, whether all the sensors are working perfectly fine. The proximity, the barometer, light sensors, the gyroscope sensors. So it seems like everything is working on a perfect synchronized manner. To come out of it, you again press. Yeah, you double press the backspace. Now here is the most important thing and uh, as you all know that Samsung is known for producing one of the best displays in the market. So sometime what happens that uh, your phone fell down somewhere or you might get a defective unit where the touch is not working properly. Maybe the touch is working fine on, on the center of the phone but maybe on the sides it's not perfect. So this is the best way to check because the screen cost almost 70% of the price of the phone and Samsung is known for producing one of the best OLED screens. So sometime the screen might be working functional on the center of the screen but you might have dead pixels at the bottom or on the side so you will lose the touch sensitivity. Now the best way to check is you swipe your finger all across all across the borders and you can see it's very neat and very easily my finger has been recognized so there is no dead pixel or no dead area in the phone also you can check the center area yeah everything is perfect again to come out of it you click on the volume up key Let's put the phone into the sleep mode. Speaker is again one of the most important things. Again. Now the LED lights for notification. You have a red, green and blue. So all are working perfectly fine. Also, you can check the iris camera test.
how the black looks so this is your sensor hub self test it says pass to come out of this menu you have to double click and here you are also just to check you I mean slash zero six will give you the information of your IMEI number now you google about your IMEI and you can check whether your phone has warranty or not also try to avoid refurbished phones as they might look quite lucrative as the prices are quite cheap but most of the parts are reassembled and also the camera RAM etc have been changed and they will perform slightly different than the original factory settings one it will never perform as the original device which is never opened well that's it guys uh, i hope you like the video if you like the video kindly subscribe to my channel and hit the thumbs up see you in my next video till then goodbye signing out